Far out in northern Tanzania lies a lake that does not behave like other lakes on Earth. From a distance it shines with a soft red glow, quiet and calm under the African sun. But the closer you come to it, the more you feel as if the place is watching you. Lake Natron is beautiful, but it is also dangerous in a way that scientists still struggle to understand. The water is rich with minerals that can burn skin like fire. It is so alkaline that it can turn fallen birds into stone like sculptures left behind by time. And yet, in this hostile place, life continues to exist in ways no one can explain. Flamingos build nests on the salty crust. Tiny organisms survive in water that should kill them instantly. Nothing here follows the rules of nature. Local villagers say the lake is guarded by restless spirits. Fishermen refuse to sail too close. At night, the red surface becomes a silent mirror, reflecting shapes that do not always belong to the living. Some travelers report seeing figures standing on the water before disappearing the moment they blink. Scientists have studied the lake for years, but the mysteries only multiply. Why do some animals survive while others turn to stone? Why does the lake glow differently on certain nights? And why do people who approach its center feel an overwhelming sense of being observed? Is the answer hidden in the chemistry of the water? Or is something else at work beneath that red surface? What secrets are sealed inside a lake that seems to both destroy and protect life at the same time? And if Lake Natron can preserve the dead so perfectly, what stories is it waiting to reveal? This is The Napoleon Files. Click on the subscribe button.